Good evening folks, Mark Duhari here and welcome back to another episode of Dawn of Man and thanks to everyone who'd hit the subscribe button since you like these videos so I will be continuing so remember if you like this content feel free to hit the thumbs up button and leave me a little comment if you didn't like it you can use the thumbs down button but then please let me know in the comment section what you didn't like so I know how I can improve and feel free to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell that way you will get notified when I post new content to the channel but yeah let's continue where we left off the last time and and see where we can go in this episode. Oh, I don't have any wood anymore. Look, I cut down trees. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Food. It has its heights and it has its lows. Uh, I'm going to have to uh, work on that. Straw. Do I have some excess straw? Yes, I do. I have some excess mud. Mud. I have some logs. So I'm going to be upgrading this one. And this one. Someone died of old age. I have survived on the winter. A goat has been slaughtered. Mark has died of old age. And I have my first outfits. This means I'm going to be able to get rid of those soon. The trees grow back, yeah. Once you start stopping uh, st stopping uh, collecting the trees, they do grow back. They do grow back very slowly though, but they grow back. I definitely need a flax field. Which I have not unlocked like, yet. No flex for me. Oh wait, you know what? Let's try this. So Einkorden. What does it give me? It's resistant to disease. But that's all. It doesn't give me another bonus. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Plant. Barley. Yeah, the barley is okay. But it's uh, the other one. Trader has arrived. Let's check that first. Oh, he's high. Plant Emmer. What does Emmer give me? Twenty-five percent to get extra resource called grain. Nah. I think it's the rye which gives you 50% chance of getting uh, an adi additional grain. Actually, you? Yeah. Do I have a uh, tannin collection area here, maybe? Nope. So, yeah, let's get rid of these. Maybe I can put in some stuff up there. This is a chestnut tree, though. Well, 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 well. Storm incoming. I, I need some more meat. Is there some more meat walking around? Well, that's not really in my area, but. Mm, what are you? Mouflon? An old mouflon. They are not crossing the river. <laughs> I think they know crossing the river might mean death. They are crossing the river. Well, first of all, you die. And then 
all of you die. Let's do it. Okay, I could destroy the, the pear tree, but do I really want to do that? Oh, you know what? I can uh, place this one. Well, that, they, they got a, two of them, so that's fine. Number three. Let's go get number four. It is very, very <laughs> frightening. Thunderbolt and lightning, very, very frightening, yeah. What is that actually? No, 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 not the white horses. Ah, crap. Okay, that should give us some meat. Hunted a couple of bow too. And I have unlocked the points to unlock the flax. So let's put in a, a flax field. Cut down trees, okay. Plants, flax. Can I get closer? Yes, I can. There you go, flax field, done. Uh, flax domestication unlocked. New farmer. Another achievement or milestone unlocked. Fine. And I got two points out of that. What do I still need? Yeah. I'm not going to be playing for a lot longer, folks. I uh, think next thing I will unlock is probably going to be... Megalithism. I want to build some dolmen, some many, and maybe a stone circle. Would be nice if I could place a stone circle up there, actually. I have one, two uh, many in my area, so that might work. Was the status on raw skin is fine. Dry skin is fine. I have some tannins. Why am I not making leather then? Maybe I was making leather, but it's already all used for things. Actually, four. You should no longer be doing that. Can probably lower you to something like this. I do not need those anymore. Well, I do need them for now, but once I have enough flax, I certainly don't need the leather ones. Which means I will have too many hides or letters. Do I have everything required to upgrade? I have logs, I have sticks, I have... Yeah, I do. So let's do it. Let's do it. Okay, they... I think I'm missing a... Some uh, storage of... This here. I cannot place the second one, then let's cancel this one. Let's see if I can do it the other way around. Storage, uh, the haystack. I just can't. It would be nice if you could raid my little settlement. Yeah. But you know what would happen? They would change a few things because, yes, if, if if multiplayer happens, you will not be running into my towers. You will try to lure my people out, get them away from the towers, so they would have to compensate for that somewhere. 
I think adding multiplayer to some games is, yeah, is searching for trouble. <laughs> you, you would get the gigas. Yeah, you would bring your mammoth and stuff like that and and trample all my buildings down. I know you, Reto. You would do that. Trader has arrived. Let's check that first. Ah, oh, he's high. I don't care. Rox sledge is no longer usable. Oh, the food is going up, which is nice, but that's because we have been hunting down the Rox. The the cow. Oh man, there is a lot of stuff up here actually. You know what? Kill them all. I can't really tame them anyway. Status, food, meat, okay. But that's probably because we have been killing a lot of... Uh, you know what, I'm gonna try to squeeze in a another st stable up here. It's not necessary, but for the future it will be. this and storage would like to have one of these in and maybe have also a storage of his hay oh yeah I have points again what is this well digging yeah well digging is interesting kind of want this though Let's do it. Let's go get some uh, many. How will they bring that across actually? Across the water I mean. That's for I need one more. I have four now, I need the fifth will be this one. And then I should be able to place a Stonehenge type building up here. No, 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 not this one. Oh, perfect. Perfecto. I'm gonna be saying strange things now, but I, I me personally, I don't really expect this game to have multiplayer. I mean, for its 20 euros, it's giving me enough fun and things to do for a, a certain amount of hours, which for me covers the 20 euros I would have to pay for it. Maybe if it would cost 30 euros, I would say, yes, multiplayer would be nice. 40 euros, I would say, too much if it doesn't have multiplayer. But then again, if they could add in multiplayer after, but I think that's that's not really possible. Add multiplayer afterwards with a DLC or a mod or whatever. I don't think that's possible because you would have to balance out everything, which will be very tough to to do after the fact. Well, the settlement is growing. I like that. Let's uh, say a prayer for Imag. Died of old age while working on the fields, apparently. Yeah. Man, just if they could just do me one favor and add a key to hide, hide all user interface. Like this would be perfect for a screenshot. But no, there are tons of things. My first megalith is being rolled in, is it? Goat slaughter. Why? Why, oh why? Ah, <sighs> why? Why did they kill the last goat? I mean, I have plenty of food. 
Why? 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 So they pulled in the first one. They will be pulling in the second one. So this will be the third. Number four, number five should be enough to make the Stonehenge. Also, food is going back down. So I need one more field. Let's see if I can place... I don't have that unlocked yet. Yeah, the flax is going fine, I think. Radar attack. Yeah, I'm gonna be going to bed pretty soon too, Reto. Oh, wait. It's like four of them. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> they are afraid of the water. I'm lucky. Where are they going to? Oh yeah, they can cross the water here. They will just get... Get wrecked! Wait, what are you attacking? Oh, my dog? Oh, they killed a dog. They killed one dog. Okay, I think I can live with one dog being killed. Number four is being prepared. I can actually cut the oil. I kind of like that the pear tree is in the middle of a uh, of a barley field, so I'm gonna leave it up there. Wait, this is not correct. Uh, do you need six for that? Hold on, pause. Ah, you do need six. Okay then. Prepare this one for transportation. Prepare this one for transportation. And I need to find a number six. Where is the number six big stone? Are there still flint mines up here? Nice. Let's get this one here. I thought you needed five for the stone circle. Maybe it got changed to six, I don't know. It's always been six. I thought it was five. One, three, five was what I had in mind. Oh no, it has been six because in my previous play session I placed six menhirs and tried to recycle that to get the Stonehenge and I did. <sighs> yeah, that was a mess. Okay, let's run. I think once the Stonehenge is built, I will call it a day. I think I have been streaming for about four hours probably. Can't remember. Three to four hours. So once the Stonehenge is done, I'm off to bed. Seven things unlocked. I can get the boar, but do I want the boar? Probably not. I can get the bridges, but I don't need them. I could save my points for 
that. Oh, the well. I need the well. Well, well, well. Let's build some wells. Um, production. No, not storage, but production. Once I have the well, they will no longer be required. My people will no longer need to go get water from uh, the river. Well, I don't need any here because those are close to the river, but maybe in here somewhere. Pigs. Ah, uh, pigs. I don't need pigs, man. Pigs. I don't know. They 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 grow at an insanely fast rate. <laughs> it's insane. Well, bacon barbecue bacon would be interesting, but I don't mind people dying of old age actually. I prefer that to me making a mistake i mean this people dying of old age isn't my fault that's game me mechanics it's not i haven't caused that i still wonder how they will be f pulling that across the water will they also make the detour and and try to pull it i think they will Will be a drop in the food, but what's happening? What's happening? Animal control. Another milestone unlocked. Nice. Hmm. Do I need more mouflons? Yeah, why not? Oh, not wrong button. Wrong button. Have 34 and 30. Still not enough. I mean the cloth, the new wool and flax clothing. Combined, it's enough. But I can probably turn that off safely now. I don't need that anymore. I don't need these anymore. The flax, f the flax field should be giving me enough linen to actually make clothing for uh, the summer. And the sheep should give me enough wool to actually make me clothe for the winter. Clothing for the winter. St Stonehenge is almost up. Almost, not yet, but almost. Let's see. Let's see what's happening. What's happening? Uh, wait, that's a strange name. Zamigak has died of old age and a new human has been born. And I have survived another winter. So yeah. Another human has joined the settlement. 44 people in my settlement. It's gonna get... Tough now. 48. Oh look, Stonehenge has been built. No, no, not this button, but this one. It's almost done. Check the limits on sheep. I think the limits on limits on, on all creatures are about 20-ish. Oh, no, unlimited. Okay, it's fine. I got five more points which allows me to unlock something new but first of all let's check this uh, we unlocked another milestone but yeah folks 
I think it would be a lot better if I wrap this up for now. Oh man, I'm gonna get the pigs anyway. But, 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 uh, trader. Uh, no, 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 this is not bueno. Not bueno. Sadly, this is all the time I have for today. I hope you did enjoy this episode. And if you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button and leave me a little comment. If you didn't like it, you can use the thumbs down button. But then make sure you let me know what you didn't like so I know how to improve in the future. Check the description for links to so social media pages, links to ways to support me, a link to our Discord server where you can hop on and have a chat with us. And also a link to the Twitch channel where I'm streaming this game and a few other games as well. And while you're on the YouTube page, feel free to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. That way you will make sure you will help me reach my next subscriber goal and you will get notified when I post new content to the channel. And that being said, I'm going to be wrapping up today's episode. So until next time, have fun and stay safe. Bye bye.